one and all, members of the Salivation Nation. And these are some slabs from NGC Fresh. Come back for my friend's collection, oh, and I'm here with a friend of a friend who's not my friend to this day. Still, oh my god. Still not my friend. I will never be your friend. But uh, that's okay, because we got some pretty interesting old European coins we're going to take a look at that came back with some... Euro what? What's that? Euro what? Euro... Oh, Euro... Europe. I thought you said European. European. Oh yes, I, we're not a European. We're actually just we're no bowel movements, no no bodily fluids, nothing like that. These are just coins from a certain part of the country where there's a, where they speak different languages. Kind of and, like you. Exactly right. That's right. So here we have a 1904 Germany, a two mark Bremen, MS64. Beautiful luster on this piece for sure. Wonderful, and it has the, uh, the uh, what we know as the coat of arms there for Germany. Very nice piece indeed. And then here we have an 1818 German Thaler, uh, Prussia. Very nice. It's got some surface hair lines, and uh, it's, but it's essentially it's not it doesn't have a numerical gray, but it's a AU with some details as as as, as obvious as you can see there. But uh, very nice indeed. Uh, beautiful design. Love that eagle on the reverse of it. 1818 is it. Uh, date on this particular piece uh, with a D mint mark. So it must have been minted in Denver. Actually, no, it's probably uh, Dusseldorf or something. Like that. <laughs> Hard to tell. <laughs> Anyways, moving along, we have a 1784 German Thaler, Prussia. Uh, very fine with details with some surface hairlines. But look at that history in this piece indeed very very nice uh, he's almost as old as you almost as old as i am that's right and i'm pretty old and here's reverse this the same type of eagle as we can see as this 1818 uh, strike here but not nearly as in good condition there. but you'll notice the mint mark oh the mint mark yes let's take a look at the mint mark on that one very good yes you got the d then on this one Wow, it has an A between the dates. Very nice. Very nice indeed. The good point. Good point, friend of a friend who's not my friend. And now we have a Parma details. Italian, 1832. Beautiful classical piece here. Very, very nice indeed. Look at that. It has a coin turn orientation. And we see its coats, coat of arms there. Very nice. Next in line, we have the 1888 German Prussia, Frederick III, AU55. Beautiful, very nice coin. Still lots of luster. Still lots of luster on this one, exactly right. Very nice. 1888 is the year of issue for that one. Very, very nice. Moving ahead, we have the 1908. Uh, there, a German. Look at that two-headed okay. uh, bird there on it, eagle. Very nice. And on the other side of it, we have the ever-so-popular coat of arms there with the eagle. Very, very nice indeed. Beautiful coin. MS-62, Palestine, 1942. That has a lot of nice original luster to it, MS-62. Very, very nice indeed. And on the back side, we have the denomination 100 mils i can read that but you won't like it oh you can read the arabic below it i bet you it says 100 mils in arabic is my guess the how did you know i just you know made a wild guess you know what i'm saying next we have the 1910 german sax weimar s notch weimar yeah, i think that's how you pronounce that i'm gonna assume it is and and not say anything more about it no we won't and very nice. Look at that luster on that reverse of that. Beautiful. Very, very nice. 1910 is the year of issue for that one. And it's on center. And it's and it's on center. That's right. Which is a, definitely a plus in my book. And finally, we have the Saxony 1902 German Albert's Death. Beautiful coin. Very nice indeed. So I'd like to extend the... Hope you enjoyed this collection of coins. I'd like to extend the multitude of gratitude y'all for watching. Encourage you to please rate comment and subscribe.